my bed It just grand shook my hand No was all I said Lane Hardy is an 18-year-old singer who is currently competing on season 17 of American Idol. If Lane looks familiar, it's probably because he appeared as a contestant on season 16 of American Idol last year. Originally from Livingston, Louisiana, Lane's interest in music goes back to when he started to play guitar at age 7. On his website, Lane says he was born and raised in Louisiana and always thought and dreamed in sound, rhythm, and beats. He says he uncovered his passion for music during his first guitar lesson with local musician and music shop owner Jody Mayerux. Lane attended French Settlement High School, and in 2016, he created the group The Band Hardy, which bills itself as cousins doing what they do best. The band's focus is country music, and Lane's own musical background is heavily influenced by the old country, classic rock, and swamp pop sounds he heard growing up. Lane explains mom who convinced him to try out for season 16 of American Idol. He chose to cover Hurricane and admitted he was nervous when he got his shot in the audition room at Mardi Gras World in New Orleans. Lane impressed judges Lionel Richie, Katy Perry, and Luke Bryan so much with his gritty vocals that they sent him to Hollywood without even taking a vote. Unfortunately, Lane had a rocky performance of Justin Bieber's Love Yourself during Hollywood Week. Broke my heart but couldn't say. Don't look at us. The dance and choreography did not go so well. I am more of a singer than a dancer, I can promise. Although he had some trouble with the lyrics, Lane stood out enough from the rest of his group and advanced to the top 50. Lane's performance of Leonard Skinner's The Ballad of Curtis Lowe during the final showcase ultimately sent him home, ending his season 16 idle hopes. Well, I used to wait the morning before the rooster crow. He explained he picked the song because it reminded me of home and driving down a dirt road in my truck and having a good time. Since that time, Lane has gone from a relatively unknown country singer to a teenage heartthrob with a social media following that many artists can only wish for. He currently has more than 230,000 followers on Facebook and more than 225,000 followers on Instagram. Lane also has his own merchandise line, which he features on his website and a YouTube channel filled with covers and original music. We will post the link to Lane's social media accounts in the description below. On the day he graduated from high school, Lane announced the release of his first three singles, Louisiana Lady and In the Bayou, which are original music and a cover of his American Idol audition song, Hurricane. He also released a song called Blue Christmas ahead of the holidays in 2018. And when those blue snowflakes start falling. Lane made an unexpected return to American Idol when his childhood friend Aston Gill auditioned for season 17 of the show. Aston is the sister of Lane's best friend and Lane came along to offer support and play the guitar for her audition. Aston sang Kristen Stapleton's Broken Halos for her audition, and while there were a few pitch issues, all three judges voted yes, and Aston got her golden ticket. After Aston's performance, Judge Katy Perry said she missed Lane's voice and asked him to sing for them. Lane sang a raspy rendition of The Weight by the band. You tell me where a man might find a bed. Come on, man, what is this? Where'd you get this confidence? What is this, what? My hand, no. Judge Katy Perry immediately grabbed a golden ticket, and all three judges tried to convince Lane to take it. At first, Lane seemed hesitant, but then Lionel told him, You found everything we said. It's sitting right here. All we're asking you to do is reach out and touch it. You can go to Hollywood and have a great time. More important, this time, you've got a shot. It sure is shiny, Lane remarked, and after a brief pause, he finally said, Okay, and grabbed his golden ticket heading to Hollywood for the next stop on his season 17 journey. During Hollywood week, Lane ended up being in the same line of 10 group as his friend Ashton, and he performed She Talks to Angels by the Black Crows. Lane advanced to the group round and was shown in a group called Diamond Dixies that also include Lacey K. Booth, Katie Bell, and Colby Swift. The group performed Grenade by Bruno Mars, and despite forgetting the lyrics, Lane advanced alongside everyone in his group, except Kobe. 
Lane's Hollywood Week solo performance was not televised, but he was shown in the first deliberation room with several other Season 17 frontrunners and ultimately advanced to the top 40. Lane hit the stage in a suit and tie for his top 40 solo performance, asking the crowd, are you ready to party with a hearty? He then proceeded to perform a rockin' version of Come Together by the Beatles, earning him a spot in the top 20. Lane performed his soulful rendition of Sam Cooke's Bring It On Home To Me for his top 20 solo performance. After his performance, the judges had only positive things to say, with Judge Katy Perry telling Lane that he was literally commanding the stage. For his top 20 celebrity duet, Lane performed The Weight by the band with singer Ellie King. Take a load off Annie. And you put the load right away. After his performance, Judge Lionel Richie said, You have really stepped up. You have developed into a wonderful artist. Lane also got a surprise visit from his brother Kyle, who said, It makes me the proudest person in the world seeing him go so far. At the end of the night, with only one seat left to advance to the top 14, Judge Katy Perry announced that Lane would be moving on to the top 14. Lane now moves on to the live shows to continue his season 17 journey. Do you think Lane has what it takes to win season 17 of American Idol? Let us know in the comments below, and thank you for watching.